We got us a Walking Liberty Ender. My first find since I come over to Bottom Feed with Scott. Looks like we got us a big old dandy button. Let's see what we have. Oh yeah. Got us a Benji. Thinking we got some silver here. Oh no, it's not. We have us a walker. We got us a cat bust. I can't make out a year or anything yet. That is awesome. Hey everybody, Rick from Hunting Southwest Ohio. Welcome back to the channel. We're back once again with a nickel hunt. It'll be episode 47 of the Nickel Hunt and Fill series. Albums are here. Another fresh box and still five spots to fill. In the Jefferson albums, we got about 40 spots to fill in the Buffalo book, so we need to get some finds. We need to fill a couple spots this hunt, hopefully. So let's pop this open real quick. This one's been sitting here for a little bit. I'm sure it is. Yes, it is definitely circulated. No oldies on the end of those two or those two, but definitely circulated nickels. So we'll take it. We're going to get into this. We're looking for the same thing as usual, errors, varieties. Silver war nickels, buffaloes, v nickels, foreigns, or anything else cool we can find. So let's quit talking. Let's break into some rolls. Be back with the first find. Roll number three and first 40s nickel. And it's going to be a 1940 out of Philly. Roll number seven, first 50s nickel, be a 1958 out of Denver. Roll number 11. Well, we've got our second 40s nickel. Going to be the second 1940 of the hunt. And another Philly model. Same roll. And second 50s nickel, finally. 1953 out of Denver. Roll number 12. And third 40s nickel of the hunt. This time we'll have a 1941. And it'll also be out of Philly. Roll 14 and 50s nickel. Number three, we're going to have a 1954 out of Denver. Same roll, 1958. 50s nickel number four, also out of Denver. And still the same roll, 50s nickel number five. 1956 out of Philly. Roll 16 and 40s nickel number four. We'll have a 46 this time out of Denver. Roll 17 and 50s nickel number 6. It will be another 1958 out of Denver. Roll 17 and another 50s nickel. A number 7 of the box already. 1954 out of Denver. Roll 19 and look at that. 1938. We're going to have to look this one over real quick. This one's in pretty decent shape. We have to check this real quick for the DDO and the QDO. And I am not seeing anything right off. more damage once you get it under the scope but it's probably going to be an upgrader i believe compared to the one we have in the album we'll see very nice roll 20 40s nickel number five it's going to be a 1948 this time out of philly roll 23 just pop this one open and i think right here is that color we're looking for again and yes it is 1943s first war nickel of 2023 we'll take that very nice rule 25 and 40s nickel number seven I mean, 1946 out of philly check that real quick for the henning nickel and not seeing the notch in the r all right Moving on to the next one. Roll 27. And we got another 1946 out of Philly. Check it one more time for that notch on the R. 
and you're looking at that left leg of the R, there's a hole in it down towards the bottom if it is a heading nickel, but not seeing it. Very cool. Roll 28. And we're going to have a 1957 out of Denver. Roll 30. And 50's nickel, number 9, 1952 out of Philly. Roll 32, and we're going to do yet another 50s nickel here, and it's going to be a 1952 out of Philly. Same roll, and another 50s nickel, another 1954, ooh, a 54S this time. We'll take that. That could be an upgrader, maybe. Roll 33, and we got another 40s nickel. It'll be a 1949, pretty rough shape. Will we have a mint mark? We will not. It's going to be a 49 Philly. We'll take it. And still the same roll. And another 40s nickel in this roll. This one will be a 47. And it's going to be a 47 Philly. Very nice. Roll 34. And another 40s nickel. They just keep coming. Another 1940. And this one's going to be a Philly. Roll 45, and yet another 50s nickel. They are piling up. We have uh, 11. This will be number 12. We have 1959 out of Denver. Still the same roll, and it's going to be another 1940. 40s nickels keep piling up as well. This is going to be number 12 for the, no, it's number 13 for the 40s. Forgot the war nickel, and it's going to be... A 1940 out of Denver. Roll 36. And still, the 40s nickels keep on coming. This will be a 1941 out of Philly. Roll 38. And I was looking at this one here. We got a 46. I know there's another one a little bit further back. And this is going to be a 1946. And it is going to be a Philly. Let's go ahead and check this for the Henning nickel. And we're looking at that left leg of the R. And we're looking for a little notch down towards the bottom right in this area. Not seeing it, but we'll take a 46. And a few more back here. I seen this as I was looking at that one. We have a 1948. And that 48 is going to be a Philly. I believe that is 16 40s nickels. That is awesome. Roll 40. And the 40 nick, 40s nickels are still coming. We're going to have another 1946. Another Philly model. Check again for the Henning nickel. Not seeing a notch in the R. I'll just confirm. Yes, it is a 46. We will take that. That is number 17 for the 40s nickels. Very cool. Same roll. We already got a 38 this box now. We got a 39 looking back at us. 1939. And it's got a mint mark. 39D. That could be a spot filler. I think we still need a 39D or an S. I can't remember which one. Either way. Key date. In the box, that is awesome. Still the same rule, following that 39D, which was awesome, is a 1940 out of Philly. Roll 41, and we're back on the 50s nickels this time, and it's going to be a 1952 out of Philly. Very nice. Roll 43. And we're starting out real quick again. Another 40s nickel. It's going to be another 46. And this one will be out of Denver. Same roll. And another 40s nickel. It'll be a 41 this time. And we're going to have a 41 out of Denver. Same roll. And a 50s nickel. It's been a minute since we've had one. And it's going to be another 1959 out of Denver. Roll 47. And another 40s nickel. I don't know where we're at. 20, 21 now. It's been a crazy good box for 40s finds. And it'll be a 40 Philly. Roll 48. 
and still 40s nickels. This one will be a 47, and this will also be out of Philly. All right, that is it. 50 rolls hunted, and it was a really, really good box. We got some possible upgraders here across the top. Probably the most possible upgraders I've had in the box in a little while, so hopefully we can upgrade a few. And then we had our 50s. We ended up with 14 in the 50s. 21 in the 40s, believe it or not. So we had a 49, 48, 47, 46. We had a 43 silver. We had the uh, 41s, the 40s. We had that 39D key date. And we had a 38. We had one foreign, which was the Canadian. So all in all, we ended up with 30 seven finds in this box that is really really good i guess 38 if you include the canadian so i will take a nickel box like this any day got our first silver nickel of 2023 war nickel which is awesome was hoping for the first buffalo of the year didn't happen but that's all right we're going to get to it here eventually so be back in just a minute i'm going to grab the albums see if we can add one 39d is a possibility and see if we have any upgrades See you in just a minute. All right, album number one, 1938 through 61D. And unfortunately, well, thankfully we have it, but unfortunately we have the 39D. It is not an upgrade. So that is kind of a bummer, but still happy to have found a semi-key date. So no additions, no upgrades. We're still going to have five Spots to fill. So let me go ahead, grab the next album. We have several chances at an upgrade in that one. Be back in just a second. All right, album number two, 1962 through 95. So we will have two upgrades. This 95D is definitely a much better example, as well as this 81P. Uh, slightly better hair detail. Definitely uh, less nicks and scratches on the obverse there on the face the cheek area so we're going to go ahead and swap those out we got two more here with a chance of upgrading in album three be right back all right album number three 96p through 2022 we will have a couple spots for the 2023s now we'll be on the lookout for those we can add those to this album that'll actually put us up to seven spots we need to fill now so we do have one upgrade we're going to upgrade a 2000p Definitely much better detail um, on the obverse, so we're going to go ahead and swap that one out. Be back with a quick wrap-up and a total of where we're at. See you in just a second. All right, we are back. Quick wrap-up. So we had five spots that we needed to fill. We're going to add two spots now because we have the 2023 spots in here. So now we're going to have 193 spots total in the albums, not including the Buffalo album. And we are going to be at 186 of 193 spots now. So that's going to actually put us, we're going to go up two spots to seven spots to fill. But I'm sure we'll find those uh, 2023s pretty quickly, probably before we'll find the 50D. And when I get to episode 50, we will be adding a second set of albums, which I already have here. They are ready to go. We're going to add them in on episode 50. We'll start doing a second set. So excited about that. Hoping for my first Buffalo of the year. Didn't happen, but maybe on the next one. But the best news is, first Silver War Nickel of 2023 for the Silver Jar. We'll take that. Appreciate everybody coming along. Please give it a big thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button, and we will see you on the next time.